In this video I will teach you on how to create this trending AI images with just using your smartphone. You can use this images to create folktales videos and lots more. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, like this video and drop a comment. Let's begin. Welcome to my YouTube channel, I am Coach Isaiah Graphic. So in this video I am going to be teaching you on how to create some trending AI images here yeah, it's currently trending online and I'm going to show you guys on how to create it but if you are new to this channel please subscribe to my youtube channel like this video and don't forget to drop a comment so the site I'm going to be using for this video is called you can, you can see the link here playground.com I'll drop the link in the description so that you guys can use it playground.com so once you open it you take it to this interface so what you need to do now is to click on get started you get so i'm going to sign up with our google account i just have to sign up with the google account let me quickly sign up so you can see it right here i've signed up with my google account so you can it depends you can choose to put your work in a desktop site so that you can have a better experience on what you're working on and have it claims with it. this is a desktop site you can choose to enable it is your choice but this is our interface after we signed up to take us to this interface so what we need to do right now just to put our prompt notes i'll be dropping some prompt in the description so that you guys can use the prompt so we're going to continue with here so i generated this text using chat gpt you can choose to play along with the prompt you can just go to chat gpt just write a like generate ai um, give me an AI prompt for an, a cow or a tiger or any animal I want to use. Make sure you put the prompt well. So I just generated this using chat GPT and it's cool. So you can see it over here. You can see it. Create a, um, um, an image of a muscular lion like creature. Yeah. I will drop this in the description. So once you are done, there are different types of things over here. You can see expand prompt. You can see exclude from image. Yeah, you can see custom. You can choose to upload image to image. Yeah, you can choose to upload image to image. Listen like attentively so that you understand what I am talking about in this awesome video. So if you haven't subscribed, like I said, make sure you subscribe. So this is it. You can click on it, add the image from your gallery. But if I don't want to add the image, I want to use a text to image you get i guess you know what text to image means so you can see different type you can see this is my prompt so you can see this sorry you can see this over here you can choose to click on none this none means you can change it to photorealism you can see realism engine you can see recaps you can see jupiter and juggernaut there are different types of ai image like ai filter you can choose here there are different types you keep scrolling you'll be seeing different types so i'm just going to be choosing one and i guess okay i'll be using this nice vision only okay let me just now then when i'm done i'm going to click on this create option so once you create you have to wait for some seconds yeah you can see the image over here this is the image that was generated but i don't like this image here you can choose if you don't like it you can also choose to click on edit prompt it's, it's your choice you get it's your choice you can choose to click on edit prompt this is the image over here you can see it but i don't like the image like i said before so like i said before i don't like that image generated you can just click on setting to do some setup about when generating your AI image you can see presets you can see model you can see your dimension yeah you get just check out the dimension you can choose to high quality or low quality or fast you can see your seed over here you can see the numbers of image you want to generate you get you can see them over here but I don't want to be touching any of them so I just have to try another prompt to get and this is the prompt I'm gonna try out so once you're done doing this you have to click on generate and check out what this is gonna generate for us so once you click it, if you want to check what you are working on, you just have to scroll down, like I said before. Sorry. I have to scroll down, you can see it generating. So let's wait for some seconds. So you can see how awesome and cool this is. You can see this is a tiger. Oh, sorry, a lion. You can see this is pretty cool. Very cool. You can see it. If you want to download this image, you can click on it. Once you click on this plus icon, once you click on this plus icon, you can see different types of things. You can see download. So I'm going to click on this download. This is your download icon over here. Can you see a confused of where you can find the download icon? This is it. 
so we're gonna we're going to click on it once you click on it it will automatically be downloaded to our phone so you can see the where the image has been generated you can choose to like if you want to change this you can choose to come over here you can change it to like a tiger or a cat let me just write a tiger so you just have to like put a good text so once you write a tiger we are going to click on this generate again once more yeah you can see it over here you can see how cool this is the tiger images you can see how this is very awesome and beautiful here so you can choose to play along with the prompt you might get the exact prompt you need for this so like i said before if you want to download this you can choose to like long press but yeah you can choose to long press then click on download image then if you want to go back you just simply for you to um, do it you can see this is very cool yeah i want to show you guys something but make sure you listen attentively if you want to check how many creations you have made with this playground the name of this website is called playground.com you can just click on that um, your email icon now but once you click on your email icon you can see three over 50 image created you can see them maybe once this uh like once you have reached the limit of creation of image you can choose to sign up with another email yeah you get by just clicking on this logout below but i don't want to do it so this is all for today if you love this video make sure you subscribe to my channel and like this video see you in our next video